Like, hello? Is anybody there? No? She's not in today. She'll be in tomorrow. Hey vibes, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another video. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Brooklyn. This is Vibe with Brooklyn. And if you're not new here, hey old friends. Lovely to see you back. And in today's video, as you can see from the title below, I am giving you the much asked for sunglass video. Finally, right? Like I always get people in my um, DMs on Instagram saying that they want to see a sunglass video from me because I just have like a crazy collection and they love all the shades that they see me wear. So like for starters, I do have an insane collection. I'm only going to show you a few of the sunnies that I've kind of been rocking lately and then some of the ones that people have asked about on Instagram. I'm going to be showing you guys a range from low end to high end. Um, lately I've been been more so on the higher end so I'm not gonna show too many low ends but we're gonna go low medium and high so let's get straight into it but of course please hit the like button subscribe to my channel comment talk to me down below let's have dialogue let me know which pair is going to be your favorite and yeah so let's get straight into it so for starters I want to start off with a brand that I actually really like and I used to work for them it's called Key Australia Yes, it's pronounced key, even though it's spelled Q-U-A-Y. A lot of people think it's quay, but it's Australian, so it's pronounced key. And to me, those are a lower end sunglass, in my opinion. I'm, I know they're not dollar store. I know they're not, you know, anything like that. But for my shade range here, that's going to be the lowest that I have. I don't really buy um dollar store shades because i just feel like they don't last i want a sunglass collection that is going to be timeless and beautiful and yeah so one of the pairs that i'm going to show you i have like 30 pairs of keys it's actually insane first pair i'm going to show you are these they come in this clear packaging really cute really pretty these are a green sunglass and that's like immediately what drew me to them is the fact that they are a different shade one thing about me like i try not to get the exact same sunnies but i also know that like sunglasses come in a variety of different styles and shapes and even just like colors that like okay it might be black but this is like an off black or this is actually gray it's not black so i try to dibble and dabble and not get the same ones but i do have quite a bit of black sunglasses um so yeah and i'm just cleaning off the glass right now so i can give you guys a really pretty look into these so if you see me looking over i am giving you guys education on these shades so you can pick them up for yourselves these right here they are by key australia they are called the hyped sunglass i believe these i don't think they sell them anymore they do have them in black online i'm sure they'll come back in a variety of colors i actually recently seen like an orange copper pair but like first of all look at the quality of this glass like for it to be originally 55 dollars um the black ones are actually on sale for 40. this is like not too shabby in my opinion is it the best quality in the world no but it is better than like your dollar store or walmart sunglass these are gonna last you a lot longer they're fairly sturdy i am in love with the color to me they just go with any and every outfit like right now i'm wearing this like bandana jacket i feel like it could go with this outfit right here that i'm currently wearing so yeah these are the sunnies on like first of all look i love the faded glass from oh my like listen you could have on like a super cheap outfit but if your accessories are like popping you're going to look rich that's just how it is that's just how i feel if you have on a cute pair of shoes a nice pair of sunnies you know um any any type of like jewelry on or whatever a watch like that's all going to look really really cute um it's gonna come together really well so yeah i really enjoy these they say key on the side give you guys a closer look and yeah you guys saw me wear these on my birthday if you follow me on instagram if you don't add me on ig to see these like to see my sunglass collection that i love to wear but yeah these are a lower end and yeah if you pick them up i will leave 
the link in the description below. Again, I don't see the green online, but they do have the black, so I'll leave the link to the black below. Um, and maybe they'll bring these ones back. So for me, what makes like a really good sunglass is definitely like, what are the, what it, how, did, how well does it fade? What is the shape like? Every shape doesn't look good on every person. And a lot of these sunglass companies have the shape that's gonna be good for you. Let's move on. I'm gonna move up a little bit in price range and we're gonna move on to Desi. I am a huge, because I worked for Key, Desi actually started her sunglasses with Key Australia, the high keys, those were inspired by her. I have loved her style ever since. So when she came out with her Desi shades, I was like, oh, homegirl's about to buy the entire collection. So I didn't buy the whole collection, but I have several shades, but I'm just gonna show you two. These are actually the same exact glass, just different um, colors. And so, yeah, let's get into the tea of these. Are we kidding, steel? I literally just looked online and I'm like, she has a steel sun, I will be getting those. Like, wow. So out of all of Desi's Sunnies that I have owned, I find that the Read the Rooms, which are these right here, are my favorites. Like, ooh, Desi, I don't know what it is, but she did it with these. I know that a lot of people don't care for these because they're very large and I think it takes, I do think you have to have a certain kind of style to really make them work. I don't think they will look good on every single person, but that's exactly why she has a bunch of different others. There was another sunglass that I do have, let me see if I can, on red. So on red, I thought was gonna be the ones for me, but they're just a little too small for my liking. I know that I'm a little bit of a extra body, but okay, first look at these, like, the hardware like is she kidding like I know you guys can't feel this but these are so sturdy like they're gonna last for so long they say read the room on the inside I love the fade of the glass again I I, I look at all of that the shape for me works for me and this interesting tortoise shell which is not like it doesn't look like your average tortoise to me it's very much so it's a, the detailing on these are just so so gorgeous i don't i don't even know she really did that i love that she has her logo going across the arm of the uh sunglass these go for 75 dollars so again they're not your 55 dollars shades that i just showed you by key they're a little bit more expensive but if you can afford it i would highly recommend getting these and this is what these look like on again like you can't tell me that we didn't just level up like hello on red i'm leaving everybody on red i should right the one thing i love about these shades are that you can wear them indoors and you can wear them in the dark i am a wear them indoors in the dark shade person i will wear my shades in the club i don't even care <laughs> i don't go to the club at all but i would wear them in an indoor dark setting a restaurant um it doesn't matter to me. I love a good sunglass. I, just, I think for me, they just set off my face and they set off my entire look. I could hate my outfit. I could literally wear, I could be wearing the worst fit in the world. And if I put on a sunglass, I feel so gorgeous. So, and I apologize for the glare. Again, I'll have these listed down below. But yeah, these are just so gorgeous. Again, I have them in the secondary color that I just picked up in stone. And these are so beautiful. I at first was like, I don't know if I can pull these off, but mm, girl, I love these. They're so pretty. The the This doesn't have a faded um, lens like this one does. And I think that that's fair. It's still a light lens, so you can see your eyes, um, but it's a little bit more dark and moody. So as you guys can see, like, I, <laughs> I'm leaving everyone on red. It doesn't even matter who you are. Like, girl. <laughs> like, this just makes you feel like a boss. Girl, you can dress these up. You can dress these down. I've literally ran out of the house, put these on just to go to the grocery store, and I felt so, I just felt pretty by putting these on. They cover your entire face. I love that they don't cover the brows. I hate when sunnies are way up here. That This is not how you wear your sunglass. You need to see a little bit of brow, okay? Sunglass tip 101, we wanna see the brow. These are the stone colorway. They are also the same price, I believe. Yeah, all $75. Um, again, these are read the rooms. I'll have them listed below. I highly recommend 
you pick these up again this was the box that they came in which not bad of a box very simple and yeah if you pick these up let me know or if you already own them let me know I'd love to know what sunnies you guys are rocking out there in these streets. Okay, so moving on. We're moving on to higher end. I have quite a bit of higher end shades, but I picked a few just to show you guys today. I could do more videos in the future if you'd like, but I want to start off with my favorite brand in the whole world. It's Prada. I'm a Prada girl. Like, she is me. I am her. <laughs> like, I love Prada. I think it speaks to who I am, speaks to me, and so... I have a couple of shades that I wanna show you. Look how pretty. These are a very popular sunglass. I think a lot of people nowadays kind of have them. Um, they are very high end, they're very pricey. I don't think they have a name, um, but they're, they're, they are the PR17s. That's like the code. Again, I'll sit down below for you. These, I have them in the tortoise shell. Absolutely, like, I absolutely love these. Like, they are super, super cute. Look at the style of them. They're very different. They're unlike any other tortoise shell glasses that I have. I showed you guys the Desi ones, but there is a difference. Like, these are a lot larger. These are slightly smaller. Just even the tortoise itself is not the same. So, again, this is what I mean by, like, you can have a bunch of tortoise shell shades, but they not be made equal. That's kind of what's going on here. So, love the gold accented on the Prada glass. It's very minimal, but still really, really cute. This is what these ones look like on. Like, these to me are like very sophisticated like they're still boss girl but they're not as oversized they're not covering my whole entire face they're very cute they go with almost any outfit dressed up or down it could be casual you could be going bike riding and put these on you could be in a gown and put these on um they come in a bunch of different colors black tortoise i think they come in white so i believe they retail for 433 dollars again i'll have it directly um the linked for you down below but i believe 433 dollars my best friend got these for me so i'm so blessed and thankful for her because i mean listen your girl would have had these period because these are fire for sure so we we both actually own these and we like love them look at us like bff vibes right there's a point in time when i was like literally wearing the heck out of them wearing them out i'm like oh i should probably wear my 1000 other pairs of shades that i have so Moving on to the next Prada shade. Now these are a newer pair. I literally just picked up when I saw them at the Prada, on the Prada runway this year. I was like, I think I need all of them, but we'll start with one. Um, let me get the information. A lot of you guys have probably been seeing people wear these like, those like moto style sunnies. This is the box for the ones I'm about to show you. And here is the next pair again those like moto motor moto sporty chic high fashion girl um these go for 475 dollars they say they're a narrow fit and i believe that that to be true for sure obviously they're very narrow they're very much giving like back to the future style i have to be careful though because like they can give matrix if i'm wearing like an all black like trench coat <laughs> so i want to like be careful with that but these are these ones on. these are super dark they're black like you can't see my eyes like am i looking at you am i looking over there am i looking over here while i'm looking over there like you just don't even know like these are just so cute this is not the outfit that i will wear with these i think you have to sheep these up they have to have a sporty look to them or a very chic look to them um or like high fashion that's why they're called the runway shade because i do believe that these are not an everyday glass you're just gonna look like a motorcycle person in my opinion you have to chic these up and make them look really really cute i will be shaking these up shaking them out i just wore them the other day and i absolutely love them they're so so comfortable on the face they don't bother me i don't feel like i need to take them off they are very dark so in darker settings they will dim you know it looks even more dim but you can still wear them at night listen I always find a way to keep my shades on because it's part of the outfit, okay? So these are just, girl, these are not made for everybody. I know that everybody can't pull these off. Everyone won't even like these. Again, I like to like pull mine down 
to the bridge of my nose you always want to make sure like this part of your face is exposed if i wear them like this i just look stupid you know what i mean so i want to say that like be careful with these if you're wearing really long lashes because they will touch but for the most part these are so 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 fire like girl they come in white and I don't know what other colors. I think maybe just white and black. Again, everything will be linked down below for you. But yeah, these are like my newest pickup and I absolutely love them. Prada is my favorite. If I could have the entire like collection, ugh, I just love Prada shades. And lately they've been like really, they've been really out here doing it, okay? Those were my Pradas. I have more Pradas, but I just want to leave it at those two. And I want to get to my very last sunglass, which is by Balenciaga. Balenciaga is another brand that I love. All of these brands that I'm showing you are very much so me and who I am. Um, Balenciaga, Prada, those are like my favorite brands right now. I just, I'm a sporty chic kind of girl, but I, I do like to dress up, but I, I, like, I like a slightly sportier look. I kind of have always been that way but i also like to get into my pretty girl bag too so <laughs> i think that you can make sporty chic look really really pretty you could dress that up you could dress that down so without further ado i wore these ones on my instagram story to a wedding people went crazy and they were wondering what the brand was which was interesting to me because i had seen a lot of celebrities with these on um a lot of the glasses i've shown you a lot of celebrities have worn i've seen rihanna in them kim kardashian in them it's just like right now they're just kind of trendy but also timeless i i could see myself having these for a long time and just rotating them and wearing them um so i thought that people saw, have seen or knew that these were balenciaga but maybe they didn't so first of all the balenciaga packaging is so just like hard as a rock <laughs> super heavy so these are the next pair by balenciaga i have seen so many celebrities pop out and pop up in these chris brown i have seen men women i've seen all the colors you've seen black um they have this color they have you know neon greens like it had like every color in the book right so these are the balenciaga dynasty rectangle sunglasses i oh my god first of all i love the large bees they're so in your face kind of gaudy i'm here for it i normally don't go for shades everything i've shown you has been kind of like regular but i like it on these these are so fire like I didn't know that you could wear these with so many things. When I first saw them, I was like, oh no, I'm gonna be limited. But girl, I've worn this with a navy dress, a black dress, a out, regular outfits, just going out regularly shopping. I don't know, these are fire. One thing about these, they're heavy, okay? Balenciaga does not play when it comes to their quality. The quality is always there. These are very sturdy. If you drop these, you're probably going to break the ground before you actually break these. And that's just the, the die hard truth. So let me put these on for you. These retail, girl, like, I'm just gonna, should I sit in silence? Like, what do y'all need? Like, hello? <laughs> is anybody, hello, hello? Like, hello, is anybody there? No? She's not in today. She'll be in tomorrow. Call back. Hello? Like, are we kidding? These are so fire. Like, I I want all the colors. I want every pair. I'm trying to chill because I will be the one to pick all of them up <laughs> because I'm crazy, okay? I love sunglasses. I, I put that on my mom because she loves sunglasses and accessories and bags, and I got that from her. So I'm going to turn to the side so you can see. Like, first of all, the size of these are just for my face shape, they work super, super well. They're not too wide. They are skinny. They're so comfortable on my face. Again, I could wear these all day, all night. They are a darker lens, um, but they still work for the nighttime. I mean, I'm wearing this jacket and I feel like they go nice with this. Like you could literally pair these with just like anything you wanted to. Like they surprisingly go with so much. I'm over here like, I think I need this kind of printed purse because like how cute is that <laughs> um so yeah y'all these are like very high fashion girl high quality rich girl vibes they're giving all of it and a bag of chips and your outfit could cost you ten dollars but you put these on and they're just 
Again, these aren't going to be for everyone, but they have a bunch of different shades. So if you like the style of them, you could just pick the color that you want and they're going to still be just as gorgeous. Okay, so these are $450. Yeah, let me know how you guys like these. And yeah, girl, I will be wearing these forever and i just want to say that i know that it is literally fall dang near winter and i'm showing you guys sunglasses i thought it was insane to do this video but y'all asked for it and here's the thing i wear sunnies all year round clearly it don't even matter what time of day because i'll wear them at night so let me know in the comments below which sunnies were your favorite again these are just like a it's this much of my collection. I am always updating my sunglasses, adding more. I want to have a timeless sunglass collection so I can pass down to my daughter one day. And are you going to go for any of the higher end ones? Are you a middle end girl? Are you more on the low end? Do you not like sunglasses at all? I'm here for all any and all comments. And yeah, please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share this video with any and everyone. And thank you so much for watching. And I will catch you guys in my next vibe video. Bye.